Hello guys, welcome this Friday to Age of the Water. The game is just out. It's free to play because it's kind of a preview. The game comes out later in April. So let's just head straight into the game and see what it's all about. I think I get the feel that it's like uh, Sunken Land meets Fortnite meets The Sims kind of thing, but maybe I'm wrong. It sounds like a an interesting connection or mix. Ocean waters gradually flooded the entire surface of the planet. Cities and villages, factories and airports, forests, fields. Totally water world this, right? Ended up underwater. If anyone has seen that movie from the 90s with Kevin Costner, humans as a biological species survived. Those who managed to escape the flood on the roofs of skyscrapers, on mountain ranges, or on ships eventually learned to survive in the new world. The most ingenious came up with the idea of extracting fragments of old civilization artifacts from the seabed. The most skilled learned to build ships from that garbage. The strongest and meanest found out how to take these things from other groups. A new civilization was gradually taking shape, living by simple and brutal laws. The laws of the sea. The okay, so there is a gathering the element in this water. that we have to find resources down at the bottom of the ocean. Uh, and of course, just like in Sunken Land, we have um, people around that we can buy stuff from. And we'll probably meet some pirates as well. Move forward to the edge of the rocky ridge. Markers on the compass. Okay, we're just gonna follow the beacon, right? Oh, it sounds like there's a battle going on over here. Turn right around the rock. Someone's calling for help there. Oop. Let's get the wood trash. I could pick it up from pretty far away. I mm, uh, don't know what to think about that. I guess it's fine. It makes life easier. But not what I would have expected. Oh, this is a poor person here. Oh. So, might have been our first friend. After all. <laughs> Sharky bandit sank our whole caravan, you know, and... Whoa, who are you? Why do you have a sharky boat? So you must be a newbie with amnesia. Y'all always appear from nowhere. Huh. <clears throat> Amnesia isn't contagious, right? Oh, I got carried away. Let's get acquainted. My name is Kitty Sark. Kitty Sark. <laughs> After the bottle. When I was born, a bottle with a real cork and a note got washed up against our pontoon. The elders took the cork, the note was sold to the scavengers, and I got my name from the label. <laughs> you won't regret it, I promise. I'm a great shooter. That's what everyone says. Besides, I know that sharkies have a treasure map. Let's get it. You don't have a machine gun on your boat? That's not right. The place is swarming with sharky gangs. Well, we okay. Need a machine gun ASAP. Just pick up the machine gun. It's there in the wreckage. It's going to be a bit too hard without one. In the wreckage? Okay. Let's see if we can uh, pick up the machine gun out of the jet ski wreckage. Oh, it's right here. Now we have a machine gun. Hurry, open the constructor. So yeah. Press tab. Press the machine gun. Oh, okay. Oh, so we have like little slots we can fit it straight into. That's great. clever. Good. And then exit. I know that sharkies have a treasure map. Let's get it. Wow, and then she actually follows my uh, mouse here. So I'm controlling the boat and her. No, just want to make it around here because I already get the idea that gathering is a huge Hang part on. of this. We so we're that. just gonna Stay have a captain. quick look here. Captain, hold the boost for sharp turns. Just keep an eye on the battery's charge. Okay, so we have a battery charge. That's oh, that's that one down there. That recharges. That's good. This is very uh, Fortnite-ish so far. Huh? He wasn't too hard to kill, but I'm a bit unnerved by the fact that there were three of these guys. The tracking seems pretty good. I'm not. There's no uh, what's it called aimbot or anything or aim assist, but it seems fairly easy to follow. 
The Mantis Bar is nearby. It's a frequent haunt for unemployed sailors. Maybe we'll manage to hire some. Oh, we've got a few items here. So now we're gonna go hire sailors for our cause. Visit the Mantis Bar. It's kind of cool, this, and the handling is great, to be honest. And I'm not being paid to say this, but I do really think it's quite easy to get the hang of. Oh, I'm out of battery, aren't I? Yeah. So you can only boost, you see the battery goes down, goes down really fast. And then if you press control, you can go like half ahead, so it sails slower. I guess the boat will stick hey, here. Gorgeous. I'm Mantissa. I run the Mantis bar. <laughs> they call me female Mantis by my back, but don't be afraid yet. <laughs> you here on business or to relax, handsome? Ah, so you're looking for male company. That's pretty quiet here today. There's one sailor who was interested in work. Talk to him. Okay. <laughs> to talk to a different person, press their portrait on the right. Ah. Greetings to the free captain. My name is Jack. I'm an experienced sailor. <laughs> uh, I'm looking to work as a bosun on a decent vessel. But I can be a sailor or a carpenter. And I'm quite a good shot, too. <laughs> a jack of all trades. Uh, but the three of us on your rubber boat? Although, I know where to get a decent boat if you're not afraid to take risks. Look at the menu. Sea car cow steak, catfish, dogfish. <laughs> There's a ridge of rocks nearby. It's like a maze. Meg has decided to hide there. The eggheads are gone, but the boat has to be attacked. Oh great, let's go get a new boat. So he's just gonna hang in there. And we're gonna go to the maze, apparently, the stone maze. Let's go. Yeah. There's loot in the cargo hold. I can sort it. Resources for repairing and making things always come in handy. Oh, looks like we got company. And it feels like, I didn't realize that until now, but I feel like we have unlimited ammo, so it's kind of, it, um... It kind of, you know, gets hot, but you have unlimited ammo. Which is quite nice not to have to think about getting bullets and all that. So now it's hot, so it fires really slow. Just let it cool off. Then come around again. Ouch. Where's my health bar anyways? These are a little more hard to kill. Come on, gun. Oops. Oh, we really took some damage there, didn't we? Okay, we wounded two guys. There we go. So the boat, uh, did it sink? I think it did, yeah. Hull breach. <laughs> nice. So I guess we kind of got to have to learn whether it's a good idea to just go for the boat or go for the men. But uh, in this case it just worked out, and finally. Oh, and he's fixing stuff, that's nice. So that's, he did say he was a carpenter, so I guess that that's what it's all about. Gotta mind the mines. Mind the mine. Whoop, what? Is that him banging the boat or did... What? Why did we receive damage there? Or oh, at least it sounded like we did. Uh, so this is the stone maze. There's a boat. It's all here. I wonder why no one has taken it yet. 
Oh, okay, so we just flip boats. Hang gliders? Really? Oh, thankfully they weren't too hard to kill. <laughs> it's just a surprise element. Where are you going? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Where is the... Yep. Now we have a pump. When the hall is breached, I'll pump the water out. Where did the hang glider go? Okay, never mind. Let's go reach the workshop. And we will see what that gets us. I mean, it must be those it's like corals or something, so it's because we sail for those that the boat gets uh, banged up on the bottom. Wow. I hope we can get this guy down before we die. I guess it's kind of like you would imagine uh, old sea battles. You don't show your broadside because it makes you more vulnerable for attacks. But also keep moving because otherwise he's gonna hit you very easily apparently. Oh my god. I hope I don't die from this. See he's trying to... there we go. He was trying to keep himself hidden. Let's go. Jimmy's workshop. Come on, Jimmy. We gotta get this thing fixed up. Hello, Captain. And hello to you too, Kitty. Glad you're doing well. Jimmy Beam. My name is Jimmy Beam. How can I help? I can see that. Not a problem. Well, the money's tied, I guess. If you won't throw Kitty overboard for her blabbering, call it square. Nah. If we're being serious, there is one problematic pirate. Yeah, but it won't be easy. His trimmerin is armed to the teeth. By the way, oh. Kitty, I heard that the treasure you're chasing was already taken care of by that bastard. Uh-uh, not so fast. The new barge could use a second machine gun. There's a diver village not far from here, and they trade in restored weapons. We okay. just need to choose the hull's lining, mount the steering wheel and other modules, uh, check the energy consumption, and it's ready to be seen. Okay, so we can... Ah, okay, we can improve the uh, the ship here. So plastic, that gives us more speed, less mass. But wood gives us more durability. Metal gives us extreme durability, but we lose a l some quite a lot of speed and gain more mass. So what type of player are we? Fast and small, or light, fast and light, normal. I think I'm gonna try and do plastic. I mean, we're gonna be probably more vulnerable, but let's see if my <laughs> agility skills are gonna be good. So do we need to repair more than this? I guess it's just, you could change these things, but there were just two holes. So, I guess that's it. Oh, and then we can circle around the ship and see if there's anything else. Doesn't seem like it. So we patch the holes. Yeah. So, what if we press P? Then we get to choose the hole lining. Okay, and we can... What else can we do? We can paint it. J? Ah! That's cool. So you can kind of customize your own boat here. Just to give it a little bit of a personal touch. Just gonna go. We only have one paint, so let's just do that. Huh. What else do we have? Then we have Q and E does what? 
nothing really. Machine gun. Tap. Oh, steering wheel. So these items are already on deck. What's this? Improved wind generator. So that says power source. Metal barrel. Pontoon superstructures. So we're gonna put in this guy here. I would imagine it's nice to have it back at the back, right? But I also feel like, yeah, maybe we should do either like this or like this just to save space for other things. Maybe actually go like this, right? Then we have room for something here. I don't know what that would be, to be honest, but I'm just guessing. Require to pump water out, you can't go to see. Okay. So what? Well, we can move this. I mean, I would like to put it way out in front, right? And then should we put this on already? I mean, we have the space. And then can we turn it? Yes. Uh, it has the same shape anyway, so... Maybe put it here. I don't know if we need power, do we? Oh yeah, we need it for the battery. Of course. Wait, can we put it here? No. Put it here then. And guns, we already had a deck gun. So how do we repair it? Oh, I just picked it up. I think it might be fine. Yeah. We just need to choose the hull's lining, mount the steering wheel and other modules, uh, check the energy consumption, and it's ready to be set afloat. And there were no, nothing else we could do, right? I mean, what was P? That was this. Could you actually... Are you going to change it, it all? Or could you go like this? No, it is just singular parts. We just need to choose the whole. Let's try and set this load. After the repairs, the boat just feels different. <laughs> Machine gun is never extra. <laughs> well, it seems like they're happy, so I'm happy. Um, let's go and find those guys with the extra gun. And we have 50 more power now. Submersible. Hi, surfacers. Ah. Oh, it's nice to breathe in some fresh air. You won't believe. Looks like I've surfaced just in time. Look, the canary has kicked the bucket. Poor bird. Uh, huh. Well, I haven't been sailing it around in the air. I look for all kinds of goodies on the bottom and sell them to dealers. Family business and all that. My dad and brother work in shallow waters, and I'm a serious depth specialist. Not really. <laughs> it's dark, stuffy, and you can suffocate there. It's easier to live on the surface after all. Although I see it's not easy for you here. You're sailing around in a barge with only two sailors and a machine well, gun. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Are you looking for a sailor? Today is your lucky day. My little brother has been dreaming about joining a ship crew for quite a while. He's thoroughly sick of okay, so we... hard to find. Sail to the iron tower that used to produce electricity in ancient times. Our family business is set up on it. You'll find my brother there. Wait! In the depths, I saw that the witch's boil is heading that way. Be careful, or you might lose your vessel. How pleasant it is to breathe some fresh air. The witch's boil. Okay, so we <laughs> just got a little more new quests here. Right? So what we Stop Something about a witch, the once. witch's boil. Otherwise you'll lose the but whole lining. I do feel like we should take the uh, machine gun quest first. Oh, those guys. Oh, they already spotted us. Okay, I guess we uh, found out the plastic isn't necessarily that good. Because... It destroys very easily. But we are light. Come on, hit that sucker.
Whoa, they have uh, torpedoes. Jesus, that's, this is not a fair fight. Something tells me it's um, more clever to actually uh, destroy the boat than the men. There we go. But don't aim for the gunners, aim for the boat. Don't have to have weak spots actually, but we'll we'll learn that eventually, I guess. But we're pretty banged up. Wow. That took a toll on our little little boat. Maybe speed is not the way to go right now in the start. But we did survive. How many holes did we get? Four? He's trying to patch it up. And that's a mine. Okay. Let's go and see what we have over here. Ah yeah, okay, and <laughs> no one just realized you you got the ship at the bottom here and you can kinda see where it's going going bad. So you can also kinda plan how you move around the enemy vessels, I guess. What did we hit here? Wall is gone. So we can move on. I recommend that you check the state of the hall. Yeah, I did check and it looks bad, but how do we... If we want to get to this guy... We have to, like, go around? Hi. If you want to buy weapons, sorry. We've sold everything to a wholesaler. We'll have new guns next week. <laughs> you must be a free captain. Some people have all the luck sailing around the world, meet your crew. Seriously. I would right now, but that won't let me. Who uh. cares more about the f That's impossible. But if it works, I'll jump on your boat in a heartbeat, Captain. What do you want, Drifter? We don't sell trash here. Try the scavengers. We only deal in bulk. No, seriously? I'd be happy to let him. He's dreamt of adventures since he was a boy. Go do a deal now. But our family has an unbreakable tradition. Any son who leaves the family must Any build a weapon to take with him with his own hands. Okay. To take with it. You have only one machine gun? Let my son... <sighs> okay. I'm so sick of this place. No way. You're joking, right? So now we are four guys on this little boat, with a gun on it. and Keep we're taking in war actually, so let's see if he can mend this to some degree. I guess they can repair stuff, but it doesn't look like they can actually fix holes. So let's say for now I'm gonna call it here and I'll see you in the next video because I'm just wanted to make this a short preview, but in the next video we're gonna fix up the boat and gonna get the uh, new machine gun. So yeah, take care guys, bye!